many years ago when I was a, a real teacher, I was a music teacher. And so this question is very passionate to me. Um, the answer is it's very, very small, but I wished it was zero. Because understanding music is worthwhile in itself. Why do we have to justify a subject just because it relates to narrow excellence of teaching maths and literacy and numeracy? What's wrong with learning music for itself? And so I think that we have to be very careful when we ask those questions. Let me take the more extreme case. You said recess, physical activity, learning health, being healthy. The relationship between that and learning maths and reading and um, writing is close to zero. It's close to zero. I get frustrated with people who say, you've got to give kids, make them eat healthy and be healthy and physical fit and then they'll learn. Think of the opposite. I could solve the problem here in America about obesity very, very simply if there was a relationship between them. Because all the people would have to do is do more maths and reading and writing. Isn't that absurd? Why is the opposite not absurd? Why is it we have to keep trying to find a relationship? Like, Recess, art and music are worthwhile things. Um, kids need to have multiple ways of learning. My kids, some of them went to school not because they wanted to do reading, writing, maths, physics, algebra and chemistry. They went to school because they wanted to do uh, water polo. They wanted to do art. They wanted to do music. And I think the most important outcome of all our schooling is the kids who want to reinvest in learning, not reinvest in a narrow excellence. There are multiple ways to be excellent in schools. So you can probably get in, feel me getting a little riled up with the question. Yeah, the relationship's small and when it's there, let's take the benefit of it. But those things are incredibly worthwhile things, particularly as we get to adulthood. We need to be able to appreciate the world around us, which is what art does. We need to appreciate how we listen to music and which music does. We have to appreciate our leisure time in terms of recess and the kind of things we do. And I think they are very worthwhile outcomes. So I would like ways of being excellent at those as well. And where there is an overlap, I'll take it, but it isn't that important to me. I'm not interested in reading studies that say, if I do more music, I do more art and increase maths and reading. I think it's just the wrong question.